What's up guys, welcome back to Sailing GBU. As you can see, we're not in our normal location. We flew back to America, we've been seeing our family, and we're so happy that we got to come out here and see them. It was worth it for us, even though we missed one of the best weather windows of all time. Don't, <laughs> before we have any arguments, there was a really great weather window that was like the wind was straight coming out from the west, was it? Not straight, but. It blew west for like eight hours and then it blew north. It was a really great window to go to Puerto Rico. I'm sure loop around will be empty when we get back, but that's actually probably a good thing. Um, but coming to America was great. The food is amazing here. I forgot all about that. I've gained 45 pounds in the last week. But we didn't want to leave you guys hanging this week, so. We dug up some old files, some exciting stuff that it just never quite made a full video. But now we are going to throw them in in this one. We love you guys. We're so thankful for you guys of 2019, our first year on YouTube. And I feel like it's gone pretty well. So check out these clips and we'll see you at the end. You might wonder where we are. We're not on our boat today. Nope, we're out in mystical lands. We are going on an adventure where we are going to try not to get hurt and we're going to the, as it's called, the 27 Charcas. But we're only going to 7 Charcas. Charcas is waterfalls, I believe. And uh, yeah, it's like a big tourist thing here. We're going to go do the waterfalls. There's like a rock water slide. You jump off into the water. It's pretty adventurous. You got to wear a helmet and a life jacket and you slide around. So after this moment, we're going straight to the GoPro. Follow us on this journey as I get scared and cry. Yeah, and wish us luck. Pray for us. <laughs> Alright guys, so we got our outfits on here. We got Kristen with the helmet on. I got my helmet. Our friends, Russell and Janice, went with the white and red. Red, white, and blue. So this is a lot of safety gear. Now I'm kind of nervous, to be honest. Are you nervous? Um, uh, I already told everybody I was nervous. It's She's scary. nervous, and she looks like the biggest dork I've ever seen in my life. She's always making fun of me, but you are the dork today. Look at this nerd. Oh. We told you it was dangerous coming up this mountain. Y'all thought we were joking around. But they got a hospital and an ambulance on top of this mountain. It's not what you're thinking. We're going to go show you. The ambulance is legit. The, or the hospital is legit. I don't know about the ambulance. It's okay? Okay, so. So we're going to introduce you to the doctor first. Come on, baby. You got to keep up. Person's having a hard time keeping up with me in these mountains. So I'm gonna meet my friend over here. Hola. You are the doctor? This is the doctor, this is the hospital, so you can come here, you can be very safe. No, uh, no, como le dice? No peligroso? No. No peligroso. I don't know if I said it right. Alright, so that was the doctor. That was the surgeon. Now, Kristen, why don't you go show us the. The ambulance, because I'm scared. No, I'm not going to do that. Go show All right. I got you but back. I'm not, I'm not going that close to this ambulance. Let's see if they're going for a ride. Let's see. Don't touch it. ambulance you fall down break your leg they throw you on the donkey and they roll you down the mountain so I almost kind of want to get hurt now just to see the ambulance in action all right boys and girls as you can see we got our helmet on because it's getting real out here Kristen tell them it's scary I'm getting scared I might roll down this hill before I even get to the first waterfall it works bye Kristen say goodbye I mean say good luck you hit the bottom, Russell?
All right, guys, so we're heading out on the road again. Last time we hired a real professional, but our friends Russell and Janice rented a car on their own. They're a pretty adventurous old couple, these guys. <laughs> and uh, so now we're riding through the countryside with the gringo. We're putting our lives in his hands, and I'm nervous. So we're here at our secret special event that we're doing with the rental car before provisioning. I'm nervous. Who knows how rickety, how rackety this could be. We might just get stuck up there in the mountain and we'll never get our provisions and we'll just be there all day. It looks a little bit rackety, but it doesn't look rickety at all. <laughs> I'll say the rickety level is way down, but it could be a little rackety. So yeah, we're going on the skyline, zipper line, whatever this is called. We're gonna go all the way up, so. I think there's a big statue of Jesus up there if you're into that sort of thing. We'll show that to you. And uh, here we go. Enjoy the view. I'm not gonna lie, I'm getting pretty scared. I'm kind of shaking in my, my sandals. Okay guys, we made it to the very top. We're all the way up here. The complete wow, top. Tip, tip, top. All right guys, so when you're traveling the world, sometimes you just gotta remember to stop and smell the roses. That's not a rose. This is a roses. Okay, so we thought it was just a cable ride up the mountain. Turns out there's a whole situation. <laughs> there's a whole ecosystem up here. Pretty much they shot the planet of the Dawn of the Apes up here. And there's caves, there's beautiful flowers. And the cable car ride was pretty scary. They packed us in with like a hundred other people. I was a little worried about that, but it zipped right up there, no problem. I wasn't real, I wasn't real scared. I was a little scared. I was. All right, cave time. What do you see over there? It's a secret world. I was told there was a cavern we could crawl through, but I ain't gonna fit through there. <laughs> this is referred to in the olden times as the glory hole. No, it's not. <laughs> I hope you enjoyed that video make sure you like and comment down below don't forget to subscribe and then also guys too you guys have known me for a while now I'm trying to work on a New Year's resolution you know I feel like my life is so perfect I got this beautiful lady and I get to sail around so you know why change things but uh, I'm trying to figure out a New Year's resolution so if you can think of one let me know in the comments below. Hey, Matt, I think maybe you could work on this, work on that. But do not talk about my clothes. Do not talk <laughs> about my blouses. Those are going to be here for 2020 and beyond. We also want to thank our Patreons that have been with us this whole time and our new Patreons that we recently got and everybody who subscribed and watched for 2019. And shout out to everybody who sent us a little gift in our PayPal also, and our people that bought stuff off our wish list. I couldn't believe that anybody would buy anything off our wish list. So thank you to you guys, and we'll see you next year. <laughs> Lame joke, right? All right, guys. Merry Christmas, Happy New Year. Bye. Bye. <laughs>